If you could choose, or if I could choose one tool for productivity, it would be, and if you've been following this channel, you should know the answer. If you don't know this channel yet, do it now. <laughs> I will answer it in a second. But this is typically the stuff we discuss, anything that makes you more productive, helps you with communication, and the whole topic of new work. Technology is related to it, and any questions of being an entrepreneur. My name is Christoph Magnussen. And um, the answer is the phone. And I said, if you've been following this channel, you probably know the answer already. But what I never shared so far is my very simple tool that makes me productive when it comes to phone calls. And also my trick to actually like them because many people when you ask them could you call someone they're like ah, I don't have the number I wrote them an email or stuff like that but this doesn't make it productive I know there are people saying I use the Elon Musk method just writing emails for example but not every one of us is Elon Musk Space Global you're the best everybody get up for Elon please this guy inspires the Come on. Because if you receive an email from him, you most likely will be a part of his organization and then you also are very likely to answer the email. Most of us need to push forward things and if you want to get stuff done, the phone is the best tool out there because it connects you directly with someone else. You can hear them, you can, you, like we, we trust another voice more than just the text. There is a stronger emotional connection this is what we know from from science and i have to say it's also the feeling of you actually got something done you get much better in being short and precise in phone calls before i started to to study um, i made a short course in one of the what's it called actor schools where you learn like you rather we want to become an actor or a director or a producer like you learn about all this film stuff and I remember there was a guy and he said to become a producer for movies or stuff like that all you need is a phone and that's it and I always like this that you just get stuff done with your phone I was very early in, in mobile phones I love this whole topic with Motorola the stuff that you open the antenna that you had out of there um, there were these cool movies where they were on the phone. I remember The Matrix, you remember that? The banana phone? Hello? Hello, Neo. Do you know who this is? To me, it was more than just a technology to, that, that you could do stuff with. Uh, to me, it was the pure freedom of like, being able to get my stuff done from anywhere I want. And with this connection, being on the phone is a positive thing for me. I still see my father when he worked, he was on the phone all the time. He's very clear on the phone, but also very nice on the phone. So he also used it as a connection to other people. And this makes it for me very positive. And I know that some of you out there say like, oh, I don't like to be on the phone. But the thing is, if you like find something where you have the feeling the phone is a good thing, you are able to help yourself like having these moments saying, okay, there are one, two, three, four, five, six moments where I have a good memory of being on the phone. And now you could do that and say like, okay, I need to make five phone calls today and have them in your mind and you walk around with it and do them throughout the day. I can tell you from over 20 years of personal research, using the phone as a business tool, it won't happen. The one thing that changes everything is once you made a decision before the day you get on the phone, who you want to call the next day, who is on your phone list. And that needs to be a name and a number and maybe a reason if you cannot connect it directly. So what we did, very, very simple, and you may be surprised or a bit sad how simple it is. We used a built-in tool on almost every phone out there, especially on the iPhone. I show now on the iPhone because this is what I have as the main work tool is the iPhone mini. 
we set up a reminders list that says call. <laughs> a very simple thing. And um, I'll show you a screen video how it can look like. Yeah. Um, so I don't show you my list that's on the actual phone because they're, yeah, I mean, it's self explanatory. But uh, this is an example list um, how we do it. We call it call list. You have the name, you have the reason, and you have a number. And of course, I have the numbers in my phone. But the cool thing is, I click right away and it launches, or you can say call. And once you're done, you just check it away. And then you see what you've done throughout the day. And I can see that for the last, I think, four weeks, we have this list up, run, up and running, and I'm close to 200 calls, one more today, and then I did 200 calls in the last four weeks. And I make also notes on the phone, which I then usually later use for the CRM tool or whatever reason. And yeah, this is how I go through the list here. And once I'm done, I'm done. You can also put links into uh, this list when it's connected to the CRM tool or if it's a good friend, you just need a quick note. But even if it's a family member or a birthday or something, we have it on the list. And this list is a key productivity feature. If you're on this list, get ready. <laughs> you will get the phone call. Very, very simple. A very simple but clear hack for making the work life a bit more productive. So if I could choose a tool, one tool for productivity, it's the phone. And I'm very happy to have this list built into this phone. So this is strongly connected. Simple, clean, easy, try it out. Trust me, it will make you much, much more productive. I hope you like this and uh, make sure you watch another video. Recommend some on this channel to have a look at how you work in the new work environment and all that stuff. And I'll see you guys next week. Thanks.